Hello, my lovely people. Today, I am going to show you how I used to draw two years ago. Step one, get a reference. Just kidding, young artist me doesn't use references. Draw the head shape. Imagine a V, but kind of round, like... Oh no, that's way too thick. Young artist me uses really thick lines, but not that thick. Oh yeah, this is better. So draw a round V, like that. Now it's time to draw the eyes. So the eye shape is like... So you know the letter D, like a capital D? Imagine if you pushed the D over and cut it in half. That's what it looks like. And you have to also draw the other side of the D. The other half you cut. Beautiful! Now it's time to draw some ovals. Oh wow, this is looking so beautiful. And also you need to draw the nose. The nose is really simple. Like, there's no nostrils or nose. It's just a line. Like this. Wow! It, it looks like a person already! And it's time to draw the mouth, so like, you draw a line, and it's ba and that's basically enough. This looks beautiful. Like, oh man, it looks just like what young artist me would draw and be like, Wow, nothing better can come out of my fingertips. Speaking of fingertips, I am currently suffering because young artist me does not use a drawing tablet, so I have to draw with my fingers. My fingers. Like, do you know how hard it is to, like, see what you're doing when it's you're drawing with your finger? Anyways, we have to draw the hair now. So imagine drawing grass, except it's on a human head. Oh, yeah. Yeah, like this. Now, that's looking pretty nice. Pretty accurate to what young artist me would draw. So now that your head is sorted, we have to give them a really obnoxiously thin neck. A really, really obnoxiously weird, like, shoulders. Yep, that's looking, that's looking fantastic. And remember to like, you know, erase the extra lines. Like, young, young artist me is not that sloppy. Now, and also we, have to, we also have to give them like some clothes so they're not naked. It's time for colors. Woo. Let's get a nice skin color. Let's go like yellow. And let's, yep, that looks, hmm. That doesn't look very accurate. Hmm. I think that's good enough. Well, let's bucket tool it on. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. It looks fantastic. Now let's get the hair color, which I like to make it a really, really obnoxiously saturated color, like this. And then I bucket tool it on. Oh yeah. This is some beautiful stuff. And then I also like to use the same color twice so we can make the shirt that color. Wow, it's looking so nice. Now it's time to draw the eyes. So basically, I like to use a nice saturated color and put it on like this. And then I use a second nice saturated color on like this. But the magic part, we go to filter, then we select Gaussian blur. Oh wow. This looks like some professional stuff. And I'll also, also, you should remember to put on a nice, big highlight, like... Oh, wow! 
I love I love how the highlight makes him look. He kind of looks like he's about to cry, be like, Why have you made me look like this? Why has life been so cruel to me? Anyways, it's pretty much done by now, actually. Like, let's put on a nice, really saturated background. But other than that, it's pretty much done, actually. Hmm. I... Not gonna lie, like, I know this video is for a joke, but that blue is so saturated it's gonna hurt my eyes. Ooh, now that's a good cyan. Oh, yes. Look at this. This is like a masterpiece. This is like, this is something young artist me would draw. Like, totally, it looks so accurate. And that's pretty much the video. This video was the first time I made a video without a script. That was pretty stressful. So this stressful. whole thing was scary. Anyways, because I had to come up with the I words hope you that enjoyed I'm saying this seconds informative before video. saying them. Actually, I hope it wasn't informative because... If you're using this tutorial to make your art better, then I feel so bad for you. It's not going to make your art better, it's just going to make your art worse. Fun fact, I had to draw the entire thing with my fingers and not my drawing tablet. Because young artist me doesn't use a drawing tablet. Uh, I'm so not used to using my fingers. Anyways, it's time for this video to come to an end. Goodbye!